Hey there guys, uh, today's video is going to be about finding a spot to launch uh, and target a certain area. Uh, what I'm looking to fish is a bridge called Lower Sugarloaf Bridge. Um, the issue with it though is that it's a closed off bridge. They've gated off the fishing bridge part of it. Uh, so what I'd like to do is target that bridge but uh, from my kayak. So this is a good opportunity to kind of show you my procedures for finding access, whether it be shore or bridge or in general, this happens to be what I'm targeting in particular. But um, if you have a boat, you could always go out and get like a top spot map and then that'll give you some heads up locations to some public numbers to get started. But with this bridge fishing and shore fishing, it's a lot more difficult, especially down here in the Keys where there's not a lot of information. So this will just be a quickie on uh, how I go about um, the next, uh, part I'll show you the Google satellite research, taking a look around and seeing if there's any viable locations. And really beyond that, the end result is you gotta put the boots on the ground and basically go out there and see what you see um, and hopefully find a spot. So that's what I'm gonna probably do today. Um, yeah, so take a look at the rest and uh, hope it helps. Okay, here is the Lower Sugarloaf channel. And what we're going to be looking for is some accessible... Because the bridge is the uh, blocked off, the uh, old uh, Overseas Heritage Trail is blocked off, it's gated. Um, I'm going to try to hit it by the kayak. So what I'm looking for is accessible areas for my kayak. You can see how there's one constant run of mangroves here, so that's going to be a, a no-go. Zoom in a little closer. Some of these power poles have access for the workers to get to them, so they might be an option to get down to the water and not too far away from this parking area. Then if we go to the other side, here's the parking area, and I already see this spot is an open spot in the mangroves so that's a promising area no more on that side but then on this side again there are some walk downs that look like to these uh, power poles not so much over here but those are a couple that might be a uh, an option so if we go down can't really well you can on this one yeah so that looks like a perfect spot right there. So it's just uh, this grassy hill goes down. It's got to open in the mangroves. And we are just that close, just right around the corner from the bridge. So that looks like the definitely the, the most promising uh, place to look. And on this side, I think there was the power pole up here. And this will be a second one. I just can't see it, but there's an opening in there. So we have some target spots you definitely want to check out firsthand. So the next uh, step will be uh, heading out there and verifying it and then to see if it's a go for tomorrow. Okay, we're here at Loger, Lower Sugarloaf Channel and I'm going to try to find a spot to launch and fish this bridge. As you can see, it's a closed bridge. So want to see if I can get my kayak and fish this spot. It should be pretty good since people can't really fish it. Uh, that's kind of so-so. So we might look for a better spot. Here's one option. It's right by the entranceway there, but it's pretty steep. Looks like it used to be an old dock. We're just gonna walk this bike path down the side and just kind of look for open spots in these mangroves because that's all we need. Well, these banks are pretty steep, so something with a somewhat of a little bit of a decline would be good. Uh, the end of the road here, that's a baby's coffee, residentials. So, nothing over this way. To the east side of the bridge and see what we see there's the spot up here that I want to check out so that's what we're going to target 
Alright, here's the east side of Lower Sugarloaf Channel. Let's see what we can see. The main spot I want to try out is right over there. But there's also a spot up here and this is a gets a lot of, less of a drop off. It's more of a gradual. Well it was over there. It's starting to get steep over here. So there's a spot up here that might be okay as well. This is the hole that I was looking at on Google Earth and that's not going to be doable. Nope, nothing on this side. Alright, here is that opening. So I think this is our spot will give us access to the Sugarloaf Channel right there. Plus parking's right there. But I'll just park right here on the side of the road. As long as you're off the bike path, you're okay. It's a little bit steep, but not too bad. Looks like it's a man-made cut right here. So it just goes and drops right off. And then just right around the corner to the bridge. Now it is a bit steep, but not too bad. I'll be dragging, definitely dragging. <laughs> so that's the blocked off lower sugarloaf channel where you can't bridge fish it. So I'm gonna bring out the old tarpon 140 tomorrow, launch on that side of the road and then see what I can catch.